you you've had your graduation. Um, now you get to go out in the real world. So, but there's one problem with going out in the real world. You, you normally have to have transportation to do that, and I didn't have transportation. Nobody would let me drive. The doctors, the neurologist, had told my mother that I would not be able to drive for quite a while and not, did not let me. And I still had balance issues and I was not doing anything that could Im further impair or cause a further injury. My balance, my mobility, things of that nature. Well that year my mother and some friends of hers had planned to go skiing in Salt Lake well, near Salt Lake City, Winter Park, called, Winter Park, Utah. No, Winter Park is Colorado. Anyway, it's, it's near Salt Lake City. Park City, Utah, that was it, Park City, thank you. So we all went skiing up there, but I didn't get to go skiing. I got to ride the trail lift up one day, but did I get to ski? No, because the doctors had said, do not let her ski, do not let her do this, do anything. But then that spring, my niece turned 10, and she wanted to have an ice skating party. Well, of course, I'm going ice skating. <laughs> It was my niece's 10th birthday party, so I go, we go skating at Centennial skating, skating Area here in Nashville. I put on the skates, I lace them up, and they're little bitty thin bars. I don't know if you've ever been on ice skates or not, but they're little bitty thin rail things you got to walk on. And then you get on ice and you start sliding. But I truly appreciated my, imbal my balance impairments at that time. So as soon as I got on the ice, I turned around and walked right back out to the seat, took my skates off, I said, I'm not doing this. <clears throat> um, have you ever, you've been an ice skater before? Yes. Quite a bit? Yes. And a skier too. Have you ever gotten back to ice skating? No. Time? Same as horseback riding. <laughs> How much horseback riding had you done before you got hurt? Quite a bit. From the time I was seven years old, we it was a family tradition on Labor Day to go horseback riding. We'd always go to Nashville to uh, I've lost the name of the, the facility where we go horseback riding, but Percy Warner Park. It, it all comes in spurts, but we'd go to Percy Warner, Percy Warner Park's Horseback Riding Academy, rent a horse and go riding for an hour or so, and that was just a, that was just a family tradition every Labor Day. Why do you think you were in a situation that you got hurt with the horse? Were you did you not know enough about that horse? Were you impulsive that day? Or? I was impulsive that day. I wanted to get to know that horse because it was my dream horse. It was a Palomino Stallion. It was my favorite horse in the world. It was my unicorn when I was younger. Did you know that that horse had never been ridden? No. Well, I, I guess I did, but I, it just didn't. Miss Autonomous here, Miss Independent. It just didn't quite click.